Hello gorgeous, today I'm going to do this tutorial using gold colors and also pearl colors mostly from Inglot. So I hope you guys like this tutorial and it's a very simple look that could be worn at any time of the day and also in any season. I hope you guys like it. Stay tuned. Bye! Okay, so I have already applied my foundation and my eye primer and I'm gonna start with the Inglot number 27. It's a golden color with a little shimmer. And I'm going to be using a Coastal Sands brush. I'm going to apply it all over the bottom lid. It's a beautiful golden color. And you want to apply it a little bit above the crease. It should look something like that. With the light that I'm using, I have my window open right now. It doesn't look too gold, but you will see it in the end, uh, the picture that I'm going to put at the end, how golden it actually is. You said I like to work better with natural light because I can see the uh, true colors and the photos also come out better. When you then I'm going to move on to the color number 453 which is so white color and it has a little bit of pearl in it and I'm gonna apply it on the top okay so now you see the difference between the gold and the white and to finish up I'm going to use a flat brush from Coastal Sense and I'm going to be using color number 64 which is a gold color but it has I'm sorry it's a black color but it has a little bit of gold sparkles in it I think you can see it there and I'm just going to dab it a little bit and I'm going to make a line in the bottom just to make my eye look bigger and it's going to be a little thicker than I usually do. And that sometimes when we apply makeup, we see that when you apply it this way, you're gonna have a little line in the bottom, as you can see there, that it still shows the um, the uh, eyeshadow that we did first. So what I like to do in order to get to the root of my eyelashes is to flip the brush like that and apply it. to make sure I cover the root of the eyelash. Curl my eyelashes. I'm going to use two mascaras to be able to make my eyelashes look longer and fuller. And I'm only gonna apply it on the top. Today I'm not gonna use a bottom layer of mascara. So I'm gonna go ahead first with the final lash by Maybelline. I like this one because it separates the eyelashes very well. It doesn't necessarily make them longer, but it does separate them. So I am going to apply one coat of this one. And then I'm going to use the other mascara to make sure that they look fuller and longer. And with the other mascara, I am going to apply several coats. I'm going to use Hypnose by Lancome, which is a much thicker mascara. And in here you can see how much fuller and thicker they look. 
And that's why I always like to use two mascaras instead of one. Now, because I'm not going to use any mascara in my lower lash, I'm just going to take my flat brush and with the black color that we used before that has a little gold uh, shimmer to it, I'm going to apply it just in the outer part of my eye just to make my eye appear bigger. And it's, um, we're only going to use a little bit. We're not going to go all the way across. So I like to take the flat brush and just make a little black line very very small because from here all the way to the end of my eye just to make it look bigger you can even see the difference between these two that this one already looks bigger it looks more open than this one so we're gonna go ahead and apply to the other one Okay, and there you have it. My eye is already more open. For the, I'm not gonna use any blush for this look, but I am going to use my Laguna Bronzer, which is my go-to bronzer from NARS. And I'm going to use a NARS uh, brush number 21 for it. So I'm gonna go ahead from where my ear starts and I'm gonna wiggle it all the way down. This brush is perfect for contouring. So pretty much the way that you wanna do it is uh, take a pencil, but I'm just gonna show you with uh, this brush, is that you take it, the measurement from the top of your ear all the way down to your lip and that should give you the dimension uh, that you need for your contouring. So I'm not gonna use any uh, blush today, I'm just gonna use this to give me more definition. And the same one in the other side. And now with the same brush, where I'm going to actually make my nose look a little smaller. So I'm gonna go ahead and go down like this, just a little bit, not too much. With the same brush. Now that the reason why I'm wearing a little bit more um, color here more than usual for the contouring is because I'm not gonna wear any blush. Usually, now for my lips, I'm gonna use my Inglot lip liner in number 852 which is very nude and it works with a lot of different nudes colors that I have think I'm gonna use the Inglot number 169 this is a nude with a little bit of a frost in it And there you have it. This is the finished look. I hope you guys like it. Don't forget to subscribe and leave me a message down below. And also, if you like to see the products that I used, stay tuned because the haul is coming soon. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.